Hey, why did you guys drive all the way down here? Because that was the plan. I mean, you said you were off on Monday and Tuesday and that you wanted to see Justin. Saying that you've been wanting to see him all this time. That's something that needs to be talked about. It's who I want to be with. When did that happen? How did that happen? You, you hung up with Justin yesterday saying I love you, babe. Well, I love you and I want to have, like, a friendship with you, but I want to be with Greg. Is he listening to me? No. It was pouring, uh, so I couldn't roll the windows down and hear what they were saying. Helpless, because I, I didn't want to jump in there and, and make a situation worse. What fair to do that to me? I've always loved Greg. You guys know that. No, you did not. You told us you don't love him sexually at all when we first started the relationship. We want in January when you broke up with us then. Greg and I have been on and off. So did you have sex with him before? You had sex with Justin? That is none of your business. I just need to know, so I can get all tested now because of you. You know what's so crazy? <laughs> Last week's episode, okay? Uh, we sat here and uh, I know I know of some moving on my screen right now just because obviously I want to move myself back into where I was before <laughs> but nonetheless though listen at the end of the day last week's episode obviously we saw these two you know driving to to obviously meet this young lady here but at the same time they already knew that she was no longer interested but yet they still wanted to go there anyway in hopes that they could surprise her convince her but guess what you turned up and now you're the one that's been surprised you're the one that's in, the, in for a shock that she's obviously out here doing a madness with Someone called Greg. I mean, listen, at the end of the day, it's definitely wrong to keep this a secret from, from, from Justin and uh, Becky. Uh, yeah, absolutely. You know, she, she definitely, she, she definitely, she, she definitely should have communicated that she no longer wanted to be a part of their relationship, that she had now decided to go in a different direction. And that direction was with Greg. You see what I'm saying? Now, obviously, maybe there's a reason why she didn't want to communicate that. Maybe she was afraid of the reaction. So maybe she thought that if she said nothing, that they, them two would, would get the picture and just leave her alone. But clearly, that's not what's happened. They've turned up. <laughs> but really and truly, if somebody is rejecting you or somebody is not responding to you or whatever, then take the hint. You can't force something that isn't there. And this is exactly what has happened here. Out for sure what her deal is. <sighs> He's been with another guy. I pushed to the back of my mind for the last six months that, you know, she could be going out with somebody else. The, the 20 year old me would be like, I'm, I'm going to the house and I'm going to whoop his ass. Obviously, I'm not willing to lose him as a friend because he said, if you were in a polygamy relationship, then I'm not going to be your friend. I'm like, you know, sometimes in life, people have to, le have to learn to just let things go. Stephanie has made her choice. Her choice is to not be with you two. You know what I mean? Her choice is to be with Greg. And that's just that. Now, obviously, Stephanie probably did wrong in terms of Work by the sounds of it, she was cheating this whole time, and she obviously wasn't honest about her obviously intentions. She wasn't honest about obviously what she does, obviously, when she's not with them, which is obviously not a good thing at all. Obviously, Stephanie definitely has played her part in an incorrect manner, which obviously hasn't helped the situation. But at the same time, Justin and Becky can't be just driving to a whole other state or wherever the hell they drive to to you know to try and get an answer from somebody that's been ignoring them because that is just creepy and crazy. <laughs> But nonetheless, though, let me know your thoughts and your opinions on the matter. And we can mostly talk about it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, peace.